One last thing to note is when we have a graph that comes up like number nine and touches the x-axis and then bounces back down, uh, that is the result of, if we were to factor this out, which we'll see more uh, in our next lesson, uh, we will have um, some of our zeros with multiplicity of two. So that'll make more sense in our next lesson, but um, that's when we get something like where we have a degree four and three uh, real zeros, uh, where we would expect that there would be a difference of an even number like two to explain our imaginary roots. So in this case, uh, that one missing uh, zero happens to be because we bounced and came back down. Uh, again, we'll see, we'll uh, talk more about that and a sneak preview of our uh, solution for question number two. Similarly, uh, again, uh, you see there's a three degree and a two real roots. Uh, and you see that in this case, we also came up, bounced, and came back down. So that bounce again is the result of when we factor this out, we're going to have a multiplicity of two somewhere along the way. So there are no imaginary roots in this case, uh, just two real roots.